Hello and welcome to another class of Hype Professional and Xcode. Recently I received some emails and texts concerning the new upgrade to Xcode 9 and iOS 11. Basically the tutorials for Hype and Swift that I had caused previously were causing some errors in the new version of Xcode. In this video I want to do a few things. We are going to use the WK Web View instead of the older deprecated UI Web View in Xcode. Then I want to show you what errors you may encounter when trying to make a hybrid application with Xcode 9 and Hype. And lastly, how to get out of that situation and create a successful project that you can submit to the App Store. First, let's do a little review by opening Hype and saving out a document as an HTML5 file. This is a very simple project that will present the user with a button to push and the response of the application will be an MP3 sound that plays with a short timeline animation. So let's take a look at this. Right now you can see within Hype I have my button, I have some elements that I built a separate timeline called spin and it will spin those around when the button is pressed um, with the action. So you can see I set up an action to one, play a sound and two, start the timeline spinning. So let's test this out to see if it works. So we just do a browser test. I'll go ahead and click on the button. And you can see it works. Push the button, get a little horn sound and a spinning um, bunch of orbs. So it's nothing really exciting, but for our use, uh, it's going to work out just fine because we want to send over some audio and we also want to send an animation into the new Xcode 9.0. So to do that, the first thing we have to do is go to File, Export as HTML5, and you're going to see some errors here for IE8, Firefox, and Opera. You can ignore those because we're not taking um, our project into any of those applications. What we're going to do is we're going to take it into iOS. So we'll just hit export. Then you can see um, I've already created a folder called WK test, but um, what you want to do, let's go back and um, we're going to create a new folder for the tutorial. We'll call this one test two and we're going to create it. And inside we're going to call this file honk. It's going to save the HTML file. If the include text contents for search engines is checked, please go ahead and uncheck it. You will not need it for this application. And we go ahead and save. And there we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go pull the folder over. And Let's open it up. I want to go in and talk about the Hype resources. You get your honk HTML file, so your, your project HTML is there. But the resources are very important. These have to go over with the HTML file into Xcode so that one, you can actually get the sound to play. So anything that's attached within your HTML images um, and sounds, and then also the JavaScript that Hype creates, you want all that to go with your HTML file. So in the next video, we're going to come back, we're going to open up Xcode 9, and we're going to go ahead and work with WK WebView and build ourselves a hybrid app.